most people think only men have right. heart attacks, but it's it, it's a killer of women too. And it, you're involved in, with this uh, quite a bit here well, in Greater And Cincinnati. I had to, what you were referring to is every right. year we wear red for the Go Red for Women right. campaign. And I don't know, I flaked out. I'm Kevin so sorry. Wore red. <laughs> but normally I call this. them and tell them what to wear. <laughs> Kevin's the only one who remembered today. I so. didn't listen. Nice I'm job. sorry. I just knew for sure you guys were going to have red on. I was I like, know. she's going to have a bright red dress. Mike's going to have a bright red yeah. tie. So I wanted to dial down my red a I'm, little bit. Can so. I bl is it wrong to blame my six year old? It is wrong. And I, I, you could blame that your minds, as we get older, we forget these things. <laughs> I don't know. We're going to be stressed out. I'm lucky anyway. I'm, I have clothes on today <laughs> for you. Let's get to the weather. Oh, it was cold. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, that's a problem as cold as it is today. <laughs> I'm lucky I have clothes on. The quote of the night. Go ahead, Kevin. It's going to be quite chilly overnight tonight, so make sure you have clothes on too yeah. tonight as you have. Have you seen the movie Bad Moms? That says it all. <laughs> that is a great movie, by the way. Temperatures right now are in the upper 20s. We've got mostly sunny skies out. After what's been a mostly cloudy day, now that those clouds have moved away from the area, that means temperatures are going to fall very quickly here once the sun sets. Right now, generally in the upper 20s, the warm spot is Maysville at 30, maybe over around Carrollton too, but everyone already down below freezing temperatures in the mid 20s to upper 20s for most of the area. So once the sun goes down after about seven o'clock, temperatures will basically kind of free fall their way down through the 20s in a hurry tonight. Tonight's going to be one of those very cold, frosty winter nights as temperatures drop back into the teens. Right now we've got a little bit of a northwesterly breeze out there up to 14. That's what's giving us that wind chill of 17. But overnight tonight, clear skies and those winds are going to relax. That's what's going to allow the temperatures to really crash. So you can see the back edge of the cloud cover quickly getting out of here this afternoon. Of course, we didn't have any snow. The air was just way, way too dry for any of that. But boy, this is cold air settling in tonight across the area. And look at it on Futurecast. Not much to really show you overnight tonight. Skies will remain clear as temperatures fall back into the teens. It will be a very frosty start for the polar plunge tomorrow morning. It's going to feel like the Arctic out there with temperatures in the mid teens. On Saturday, expect Saturday to be a lot like today. I do think once again, tomorrow afternoon, we'll go into some of that filtered sunshine because we'll have an area of cloud cover scooting by across the area. But Saturday looks like a nice day. Still going to be cold for us. And then Saturday night will be not as cold as tonight because we'll keep some clouds around Saturday night and with more of a southerly component to the wind, temperatures will only fall back into the 20s. So tonight will be the coldest and then each night after this we'll see things warm up a little bit. And hey, we've been talking a lot about Sunday and right now I actually think most of Sunday it's probably going to turn out to be a dry day. This system really that we were looking at earlier in the week really has weakened considerably now. So while I still think there could be a sprinkle or maybe a rogue flurry somewhere early Sunday morning, most of Sunday actually looks dry and milder. Looks like by Sunday afternoon, temperatures will climb into the mid 40s. All right, tonight's going to be frigid though. 16 for an overnight low underneath clear skies. And then tomorrow, filtered sunshine, but still chilly. Look for a high in the mid 30s. Here's your day planner for your Saturday. Again, frigid start at 17 in the morning, 30 around noon, and then into the low and mid 30s by afternoon. Here's your seven day forecast. We're going to get a taste of spring in here as we get into early next week. Check this out. Here's our warm up on Sunday into the mid 40s. 50s by Monday. We'll introduce some rain in here, and we may even have some thunderstorms by Tuesday as we climb into the mid 60s, but then look what happens beyond that. Another blast of cold air as temperatures fall back just in time for the next weekend. All right, Kevin, thank you. And Arkansas boy.